Welcome to our channel. I'm Sylvia. And this is Ozzy, our four-legged travel companion. We are traveling and exploring Australia whenever we can. Our aim is to capture the beauty of Australia and bring it into your living room. Please come with us and enjoy our adventure. driving on to the spirit of Tasmania. Here we come. Hesse for six weeks. See you there. We are at the Port Melbourne. Just arriving at the pier. There is the spirit of Tasmania ready for us. Now we're just driving onto the cruise terminal. And now as you can see we have to wear masks. And on the ship too. I think we are pretty one of the first. Now we're driving onto the pier. The Tasmania is up there. And we have to wear masks <laughs> and uh, we have to wear them on the ship too. Oh well, as long as we get to Tasmania. The beauty spirit of Tasmania on the right side. So while we're waiting in line, I think I'm gonna give you some facts about the spirit of Tasmania. The capacity is 1,400 passengers. The length is 149.33 meters long and it has 222 cabins, 11 decks, a reception area, a small movie theater with cinema, a lounge bar, a gift shop, a main bar and two restaurants and also a children's playground. A little cruise ship. We are not so sure, it's pretty windy outside and the sea is pretty wild. Thank God we have seasick uh, tablets with us. I hope, we just hope they help. The finger is crossed. <laughs> we go, now we're driving into, into the stomach of the spirit of Tasmania. <laughs> That's it, that's our spot. So we are all ready to get up onto our deck and we had to leave Ozzy here and we nearly cry. It's so sad. We got him his bed and hopefully we'll be alright. Yeah? Yeah, he'll be alright. Alright. See you later, Ozzy. Big 
Well, that's inside. So we're gonna wait. Yeah. That's the cinema one and cinema two. Now, on oh, this side. It's like on a, being on a cruise ship, I think. Yeah, I think we are all right, I think. I think that should be it. Now we picked up Ozzy. All is good. Thank God we were so worried. Oh, but he is fine. Now we're just ready to embark the spirit of Tasmania. It's still dark outside. We are on the way to our first campground on our first day in Tassie and had to stop for a toilet break. That's when we discovered this beautiful walk along O'Neill's Creek. It also was Ozzy's first experience walking over a bridge. I think he did a really, really good job. Look at those fern trees. Shotzi loves all those big fern trees. Where's he going in? Where's he? Sit. Sit. Say hello. <laughs> That is a beautiful walk. We just came back for th from that walk. It took us about 45 minutes and Ozzy enjoyed it very much. I really recommend that small walk. The highlight of this free campground is not the amazing view or the tranquility. No, no! Every night at dawn we could see platypuses swim in the creek. We are totally fascinated by this amazing animal. The unusual appearance of this egg-lying mammal is a mix of duck, beaver and otter. The male platypus also has a venomous spur. Did you know that? This is definitely another tick of our bucket list. Hi everyone! Hi! We finally made it onto Tassie. We had a rough ride on the spirit of Tasmania, but this morning we arrived in Devonport and we made our way down uh, to the lake Geidner. 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 No, Geidner. Oh well, <laughs> we ride it on the bottom. <laughs> so we have set up. The sun is shining. It's for Tassie. It's warm. We have our first beverage, so cheers, it's all good. Uh, and it's pretty peaceful here. 
We went for a drive and had a nice uh, creek walk with, with, with Ozzy. So that was nice. And we had a look at different villages and we had to do some shopping in Devonport as well. So, yeah, it's all good. Now, I'll show you the Lake Gerdner. It's down there. And up there. We also have some drone footage. Now, what, ha what are the plans for tomorrow? I think we're gonna go to the Leven Canyon because, many walks. because it's dog friendly and we can take Aussie with us. Have a look there. And if we still have time, we go and have some further, we have a look at some further um, waterfalls. And I think that's the day. See you then tomorrow. See you. Bye. some great views of the Cradle Mountain with beautiful weather here in Tassie. Good morning here from Tassie. Good morning. We are at the car park. Uh, from the Leven Canyon and we're doing um, the Kirkshank lookout and the Edge lookout walk. Uh, this time we have Ozzy with us because both of those walks are dog friendly and the weather is beautiful, blue sky, no wind, beautiful weather for Tassie, so let's go! Good fresh air, isn't it? <laughs> it's a lovely walk so far. Well maintained. And there is no people here either. <laughs> Which is really nice. Temperature is lovely to walk. I think it's probably a bit bad. 18, 19 degrees. Hmm. Now we are already coming to the lookout. I just turned it around for you to see. Ozzy, how are you doing? <laughs> Ozzy, <laughs> right? Eh? Oh, that goes down.
doing back there? Huh? Your knees? You can feel it in your knees? Right there we go. Going down the stairs. Exactly 697 stairs. Oh, we got some stairs ahead of us. I can see that our knees. Oh, and it goes, it goes steep down too. We are doing the circuit anti-clockwise. If you do it clockwise, you have to walk up the stairs. Now we walk down the stairs. What do you like better? Up or down? The up. stairs. Up the stairs. Yeah. Now we go down. <laughs> Great. Down, I become the usual. <laughs> <laughs> Right, that's the first bench. So we can see we still have 393 steps ahead of us. We'll see how you're feeling. All good? Yeah, let's go. So it looks like we're coming to the edge lookout. Let's see what we, we got from there. To me it has a feel we are a bit further down than the other lookout. doing up there with the tree farms. So we have finished the walk. The last bit was the fern walk. We thoroughly enjoyed with all the big tree ferns. Yeah and now we have a picnic and relax and we have a look uh, what we're gonna do in the afternoon. Uh, we will let you, let you know. All right see you then later. See you. We stopped at the car park and I found those little, that little fluffy <laughs> caterpillar. <laughs> we have parked our car here at the Preston Falls. There you go. This walk is also dog friendly and the waterfall drops 25 meters subsequently. Let's see how much water it has. This is a well maintained walkway. There it is. Preston Hall. Yeah. It's a pretty hall. Yeah. <laughs> Relatives on the playground. There is a penguin. Well, there is a penguin over there on the rubbish bin. Penguin. Now some penguin toasts. All along here, and of course, there is a penguin visitor center. 
There's penguins everywhere. Penguin bakery. Oh, look what you got here. Here, we even have a penguin library. everyone, another beautiful day in Kazi. We woke up, or we had to walk, wake up early in the morning, I think at 7. At 7 we made our way to that uh, Cradle Mountain Visitor Centre. Yep. Uh, we parked there, took our uh, National Park pass with us to the visitor center and we showed them the pass and then we got the uh, ticket for the shuttle bus and we hopped on to the first shuttle on the day went up to the Dove Lake and walked around the Dove Lake that was a, a 6.2 kilometer circus very beautiful walkway, beautiful scenery, and very nice. great view of Cradle Mountain, and very, very beautiful, so scenic. Um, on the way, yeah, and sadly, on the way back, yeah, sadly, on the way back, someone stole our GoPro and all the footage and pictures on it are gone yeah so thank god we took some photos with uh, our iphone and some with the other photo camera we got so we can show you that but uh, the gopro footage is gone so now we're back at the campsite I'm just enjoying a beer. I'm having a cup of coffee. And now we take an easy afternoon. Until then, see ya. See ya. This is the visitor center in Cradle Mountain behind me, just beside the car park. You have to grab your uh, National Park Pass and show them at the counter and for that you receive the shuttle bus ticket. And the shuttle bus takes you up to a different station. Horny Creek is one and Dove Lake. So we went for Dove Lake today. Morning. Another beautiful morning here in Tassie. Uh, we, we decided we do something special for you. Remember, we were up at the Cradle Mountain, right? At the, uh, the beginning from our journey here in Tassie. Yeah. And our camera got stolen. And we didn't we lost all our footage from then so we decided to make some new footage <laughs> and we're back in the cradle mountain at the dorf lake yep in the beautiful day It's a bit windier today. 
but it's okay. The Cradle Mountain is still a bit in the clouds. That's the famous boathouse on Dove Lake. Cradle Mountain, the top are still in clouds, but otherwise it's a beautiful day. Hi. <laughs> so we are very glad we could make it again up to Cradle Mountain. It's a beautiful spot. Really nice. Really nice. Light it up here. Yeah. All right. See ya. It's just so peaceful and quiet. Beautiful. That's Lilla Lake, just beside the Dove Lake. If you walk further up, you get to the Wombat Pools. It's also a beautiful lake. Beautiful little water holes everywhere. The habitat of different insects, fishes, frogs. Beautiful. All right. We finished with our Dove Lake circuit. It took us two and a half hours, but it was a really beautiful walk. And with the sunshine like that, nice scenic. You can't have it any better. Nice views. Yeah. But now for us, it's time to head back down. Sheffield today as well, we're gonna show you. Yeah. Alright, we'll see you then in Sheffield. See ya. Hi, we are back. So, we made it to Sheffield. Now we're just more walking along the main street here. And have a look if it can find any murals. Yeah, yeah. It should be 130 murals in that town. Now we're going to show you a few. I think every second building in Sheffield has a painting on it. It's pretty cool. You can wander around all day, I think, and just photograph all those murals. And you're not finished. Beautiful. Right. 
Hi everyone. Hi, not hi everyone. Hi everybody. <laughs> Thank you for watching. We hope you have enjoyed this episode. We really appreciate your support. Please do like and subscribe. If you have any questions, please feel free to drop a comment below. See you later. Alligator.